Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Funky Steve's Medinas. So this is episode 79. I think I'm going to probably draw this series to a close, maybe around episode 80 to 85, somewhere in there. Um, we've got two series going on right now in version 998, uh, and the, the differences are huge, plus the uh, number of views in this series are slowly dropping, so I'm thinking the interest is more so in the other series. So probably what I'll do is I'll run those episodes a little longer. Um, but, uh, you know, guys, if you guys have still some interest in watching this series, I'll keep it around and uh, I'll do episodes here or there. But right now, um, we're going to take a, a clan mission here, or a mission against the clans. So let's go right to contracts. We've moved planets as well. Um, so we're going to do logistical breakdowns, an ambush convoy at three skulls in a lunar environment against ghost bear. So let's see if we can do this one. So let's negotiate this sucker. And I want to go full salvage because it is against the clans and we want to make some sea bills here or some salvage. So let's accept this. And we've got the right uh, lance in, but let's pull out our pilots. I ran a, uh, um, a milk run there just before we shifted planets just so we had enough for our um, financial report. But let's get Hellcat in and Rhino in. And we haven't been using sensor lock a whole lot, so I think I'm going to bring in Saint in the meal there. Um, just because we're in a Martian environment, I want to, or lunar environment, I want to make sure we've got the uh, um, ability to um, vent some heat here. So we're going to go this route. All right, guys. logistical convoy so we got to catch up to these guys and wipe them out um, and that's our escape point but they're gonna be okay, let's where are they going um, here really Waiting for orders. Uh, we better trash these guys fast then Moving out. Commander. Wow That does not look good. Like even if I go up the hill here, chances of getting to a point where I can see them, I gotta chase them basically. What's up, boss? We've encountered tough uh, convoy missions before, so we should be okay, I think. Depending on how fast those vehicles are. Okay, so what do we got here? Storm crow, a bear cub, and six vehicles. Sleep nears, Zora. I guess the sleep nears are the convoy, probably. Probably. Okay, well, I can't see any vehicles yet, but. We'll give this guy the what for. All weapons committed. Okay, something happened. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Find out here in a second when the mule near moves up. Here comes the storm crow. Nope. It's gonna play Lerm, okay? That's fine with me. Fine with me. Let's get right up on this convoy. Roger. I know it means being shot at, but we can get eyes on. We can determine what we're up against here. So this guy lost his arm and is almost dead. Now these guys, 115 in the back. Same. This guy's got 50, so he must be one of the guards. Hmm. Let's target the furthest guy up, I think. And we're going to leave the enhanced off until we get close. Okay, 
Okay, Rhino. Let's multi-target this. Everything direct on the Zora. Let's get rid of it. And we'll drop the LRMs on the other guy and fire. That should probably be it for that vehicle. Yep, good. One less guard. And it's raining lerms. Okay, a little bit of damage. Steve's got to move fast. We got to get some direct line of sight with those PPCs. I'm shocked that Sand is moving so slow in this mech, but not much we can really do about it. Yeah, we knew we were going to take damage. Barely hit, Commander. Yeah, 80's not barely hit. Well, at least they split it up. Ready for orders. Understood. Moving fast. Okay, you're going to be stepping on people next turn. Let's F up this guy a bit. Um, just fire the T-Samp, I think. Save the heat for later. Confirm. Ah! Hoping to make them slow there. Not much we can do now. Ah, it's misfired too. The last battle where I was in the milk run, it did the same thing on the first shot. I don't know. I'm, I like the T scent, but I might pull it out. Minimal damage on that hit. Put in a melee weapon or something. Honestly, at the heavier levels, it doesn't give us all that much advantage. And it doesn't really work against vehicles, so. Alright, come on. Stormcrow going first. He's coming back to help out, I guess. Okay, Steve, we need eyes on, Bobby. Bubba. Okay, we got enough for this guy. Uh, it's warlorded up right now. Gotta max kill these guys. Nice. Enemy unit destroyed. All right, what are they doing? Sure, man. Thanks for coming out. Okay. Good move. Block us. Block us off a little bit. We've lost the other vehicle. It's way up there somewhere. Crap. I don't know if we're going to be able to do this one. They got crazy speed. Rata tata tata. Um, yes, Commander. I want to get you up here so we can see this other vehicle. Well, that's what? All right. Got eyes on that guy. This is the one that's been damaged. Okay. Yes, Commander. Actually, no. Receiving you. Let's get on this guy. On my oh way. shit! I forgot to turn off this T sap. Damn it. Of course you do. This was too easy. Reporting. Well, not easy. Because you're getting the frig away. Alright, multi-target again.
We might have a chance to kill that guy. That hit something good. I don't know how where the re our reinforcements are over here. So what do we got? I have no idea. Something. 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 All right, where was I? Sorry, guys, I had to go to the store there for a second. Um, fell twice too. It's black ice everywhere now. Uh, hang on one second. I gotta change my glasses too. Yeah, I got a pair of glasses that I use for my computer, and ones that I wear outside. Progressive bifocals. I hate the progressive lenses, so I've got a pair of glasses I use for my computer here at home, and one for my computer at work. So three different pairs. All right, we got to kill this guy that's getting away. I use um, two screens at work, so it's nice to have uh, a pair that works for them. And then I got a single screen here, a screen here at home, which I'm a little closer to. Um, so I got a pair for here as well. Let's see if we can kill this guy. Mm, that's six damage. And these are all six. Well, this is telling me one now. Let's just fire the MMLs. Well, no. That's why we brought people with Warlord. Let's go for it. Even if it is just one. Yeah, it's just ones. We got them. Nice. Vehicle down. One more squashy, and then we're done here. Standing by. This is the sleep near, right? Right. Let's get him from the front. So we don't have our back to the storm crow there. Nice. So I have... Oh, I gotta turn that T-Samp off. It's gonna break on me. Okay, well, it's just straight through. These guys are in our way here. A demon. Hunchback T. 50 T. Ultra 5? Ultra 10? 10 maybe? Let's hammer that storm crow. Um, leaving one off, fire the rest. Okay. That's gonna help. Alright, let's see what we can do here. Uh, this vehicle's got how much armor? 100 points, eh? So, uh, oh, we can't multi-target. Well, we're just going to kill the vehicle then. That should do it. I hope. Yeah. Enemy vehicle destroyed. Okay. He's got no weapons anyway. Oh, he's got two missile launchers. It's probably got to be more than those two guys. Fucking gas rifles. I'm receiving you. I don't know. Let's get into here and burn through the side of this guy if we can. Leave these guys off. Fire the rest. Mmm, good damage. Not enough, though. I'd like to get some more MMLs for the catapults. Ow. Damage minimal. Damage maximal. Here it comes, folks. 
Oh shit, I forgot to turn the T-Stamp off again. I gotta stop that. He's going down. Damn it. Okay, before we forget. Crap, we busted it. Yeah, we're going to get like something for the arm anyway. Can't target them both, eh? Can if we're back here. God, not even there. There we go. It's got a double kill here, guys. Um, split them up. So Beal's going to take uh, that, and A'll take the rest. Let's fire. Affirmative. Nice. Tango down. Tango's down. Um, yeah, we'll fire three. We've almost got our warlord back. Couple hits, nice. Hoping there's more than two guys. Okay, we can fire three again. And yeah, doing so. God, really? 91% and two misses? Really? God damn it. Location confirmed. Well, at least we have the proper torso here. Um, let's do this. Because we can. It's a rotary five. Critical hit, Commander. Destroyed. We killed it. Wait. It said we killed it, but it still Waiting seems to be orders. there. Uh moving out. Maybe there's only two guys. Seems a kind of weak reinforcements. Sensor lock all you want, not gonna help you. XL engine, guys. If you're not confident about winning, don't run it. We got the moves. Ah, uh, side. Can't get the side I want, though. Got it. Putting my weight into it. Doesn't matter. There we go. Let's see what we get. Vehicle down. It's all about the GAC. Mission successful. Man, my body's slowly seizing up now after those two falls. Landed on my elbow the first time and did the splits the second time. My knee hurts too, so I know I hit it some... I think it was on the first fall. I don't even know. It's like right on my walkway too. It's all black ice. I didn't even notice it. I'm walking down and just like, wham. Um, we got like... Um, paving... Ah, we lost a T-Cent. We, we got paving stones in the front too, and I didn't expect it to be there, but... 
like brick stones, and it just was right, right there. Uh, ATM nine, yeah, man, let's take that. The six we could leave for now. ER, medium ER pulse. What the hell? Five hundred and sixty range. It's pretty damn good. What's the weight on this? Two tons. And that's a possibility. Yeah, I'm not going to say no to that. We can get a pair. Of, whoa, man, another one of these. Imagine get a pair, getting a pair of rotaries on something. I mean, technically, we could put them both on the um, Victor. We need a hell of a lot of ammo, though. Like ridiculous amounts. Um, Clan ECM, it is smaller. Well, weight wise. Clan double heat sinks, double heat sink kit, patchwork materials, AC5 double ammo. We didn't get what we wanted out of this, really. Um, Clan endo steel, we're going to take that. We were always looking for Clan endo. Go that route. And we got the Bear Cub part, ATM-9, Gauss Rifle, LRM, Rotary 5, which we chose. We did get the Ultra 5, okay. Clan Pharaoh, Clan ECM. So we got some good stuff out of this, Clan Heatsink. All right, not too bad at all. Okay, a few things changed hands. 38,000. And you know what? It's pouring down rain outside now, too. I just put salt down. It's all going to wash away. Ah. All right, we're going to um, jump planets. I want to find some more missions. There's not a lot of missions here against the clans. So let's have a look at the star map here. And we got our little F2 trick, which is nice. Be able to see the systems we can jump to. The smaller the dot, the uh, lower the skull rating. So this is what, two? This is probably three and a half. Yep. 20 days. Let's head over there. Well, I think we should stay on the border because I don't think we're going to get very many missions against Clan Ghost Bear over here. Um, Ghost Bear is 17. We were at Rafting a little while ago. Let's go back there. Let's travel. I'll see you guys there. Okay, guys. Welcome to Raffin. We made it back here. Um, so I'm thinking I'm, I did a couple changes to the mechs. Just I had a couple thoughts here. Um... So the main lance, the Victor, I'm tra I traded some stuff off here. So I pulled out the LRM-20 and put in the ATM-9. It's the same weight, um, but with 9 shots and 12 damage each. It's much closer in fire support. That I had to pull out the um, the Artemis, but this thing has plus 2 accuracy anyway, so the, the accuracy trade-off is exactly the same. Um, it does have damage fall off, um, but it does have evasion ignore as well, which is a, is a huge bonus. I added a tag to the arm, but I also swapped out the, um, the cluster ammunition um, LBX-5 and put in this uh, longer range regular AC-5. Um, we were able to lose a ton of uh, LRM ammo, so I was able to get this in. Um, and we did a little bit of rejigging and stuff, so it's in here now. Um, but what I think I'm going to do, we're, we have really good heat efficiency on this mech right now. What I think I want to do is I want to pull up the heat sink cooling pod down here, just for this particular mission that we're going to do. And I'm going to bring in the... Uh, oh, I can't use this with the uh, Ultra 5. Oh, right. I was going to bring in incendiary ammo for the mission that we're about to do here, because we might need it. But we'll leave it as it is for now then. Shoot, that's right, I forgot I couldn't do that. All right, so here's what we're going to do, guys. Um, yeah, nothing else really changed. The uh, Our uh, missile launching catapult, I, I, I pulled out the enhanced LRMs. It, we weren't getting the damage at long range, so it wasn't really providing us any bonus. So I put in the plus um, one damage uh, LRM-15 in here. Um, and... Yeah, we were able to drop some case in this time. We don't have case 2, unfortunately, but we do have regular case, so we dropped it in. Uh, and I was able to get a medium laser triple plus in here, too, which is bonus accuracy. Now, we won't be using it all the time, but we should run uh, more than uh, cool enough to run all this stuff. So, yeah, I was able to do a little bit of change to that. And then everything else pretty much stayed the same here. 
So let's just jump into the contract I want to do here. Um, this could turn out to be absolutely horrific, in which case we'll bail out. But what I want to do is I want to try a, a four and a half skull settling a grudge against Clan Ghost Bear. Uh, it's in Martian terrain, so uh, you know their weapons are really hot. So I'm hoping that after the first turn or so. Uh, they're going to be limiting their firepower. We're pretty good. We can fire for a couple of turns straight out uh, and with our pilots that have um, Warlord we can cool off real quick. So I'm hoping that gives us a slight advantage, but I'm going to try this one uh, And we're going to go full salvage because you never know what we're going to get out of this and accept it Now we have enough sea bills to basically affect repairs and stuff. So I had uh, pulled off a quick mission before this one just so that we had some sea bills for the end of the month and just in case we ran into some uh, repair issues on this particular mission so let's load in our lance let's just make sure this is the right version that's what you got to do when you got too many catapults uh, or any other too many of any kind of mech um, and the grasshopper now I thought about bringing the no nodachi and going melee but like I said with this mech it's like I don't know it, it's just it's not really performing for me. Now, I guess if we get SRM Deadfire ammo, uh, it might be better off, but right now it's just really not doing what we want to do. So I'm just gonna leave it out for now. Um, so let's bring our standard Lance in here. Uh, let's bring Steve in. Um, Hellcat, Rhino, and once again, we're gonna go with Saint again, uh, just because we have the um, Warlord ability for cooldown. I think that's probably going to help out more than having sensor lock in this particular instance. But uh, let's deploy this and cross our fingers and hope we don't die horribly. Yeah, I, I, I got a feeling you're right in this, in this case, Darius, but we'll find out. Alright, let's hope we don't die and let's hope it's only one lance. Oh, I got a bad feeling about this. Okay. Uh, this is bad. Okay, so here's what I want to do. Since I don't know if they've got an additional lance, um, rather than going straight through this way, there's some whirl whirly dudes up in here, um, like whirlwinds in here that we could get defense from, but they got a pretty much straight line for us, and if... It, we all know when you're facing the clans, you don't want to give them a nice big open area to shoot at you because they're long range weapons. So we're going to break off to the side here, I think. Try and use some cover. Hope they don't have a lot of missile weapons. And if they do have an extra lance that shows up over here, then we'll most likely we'll bail out. Or we might try and get one kill and then bail out, but we'll see what happens. We'll just play it by ear. So uh, between the, the last mission and this one, um, went down and had some dinner and Man, my body is slowly just seizing up after those two falls on the ice when I went out there in the middle of that first uh, mission. Ah, man, I'm too old. Okay, let's get back here. So I'm interested to see how these ATMs work out instead of the LRM-20. Yeah, what do we got here? Thunderbolt and a Timberwolf. My guess is it's going to be two lances. Ah, crap. We could get lucky. Who knows? Maybe there's a couple of 100 tonners. Yeah, see what I mean? Just not quite fast enough to get out of that area. Damage minimal. Shit, you can see us, eh? I thought I was behind a hill here. Nope, I'm still up on top. Okay. We will be over here, though. So let's get down in here. Should be safe there. Okay, this guy's 45 tons. I got a nasty feeling they're going to have another lance. Another thunderbolt. Wonder if we can um he just dis it just vanished. Poof. I'm 
here. They're going to be able to see us back here too, I bet you. Like, even if we move back here and fire. But at least it's direct fire. See what we're looking at here. 28%. Okay, that's not too bad. We're going to drop it all on them, see what happens. Start it off a little bit. Good to go. Move down to the whirly dews here. You got ace pilot. That's going to be a huge advantage. Fifty one. Yeah, no, we're going to fire in Tim Wolf. Let's fire it all. Let's see what happens. Wow, well, the AC's all missed, eh? Yeah. Cleric. I mean, if we had gone this way, we would have been caught completely in the open. There's like no cover anywhere over here. Yeah, there's like, this site is the only place with good cover. Like, if we'd gone over here, I mean, we would have had it gone up. Well, we couldn't even get up behind it. Like, we'd be trapped in a corner. <sighs> okay, well. Yes, Commander. I think we backtrack a little bit this way, I think. This is going to put us in the open. Don't relish the, the thought of being in the open here. But I think we got to move back across this way. Okay, well found not too bad. There's a few of these mechs I think if we just focus on for a turn, we can just rip them down. Oh yeah, by the way, I, I refit the uh, Mjolnir too. We lost the T-Semp, it was my huge error, but I managed to put a haywire and a mining drill in it, so it kind of balances it off. Um, I had to pull out some sinking, heat sinking, but that's not a big deal. Alright, um... I know this is a uh, taking a gamble here, but Firm. getting the whirly dues. Yeah, had to take the shot at it. Failed to connect. Okay, Steve. I uh, kind of kind of call him bullshit on some of these here. Like up there, I can see them both hitting. Here, yeah, but here.
this might be a mistake, but... Okay, Phoenix Hawk, 31%. Thunderbolt, 47. Timberwolf, 77. There's our choice right there. Firing. We gotta still start pulling mechs out of battle. Wait, a cleric wolf? Is that two wolfhounds? It is. So that's advantage. Well, I only say that because I think if we focus fire, they'll go down pretty quickly. This guy's gonna get his ass ripped in a second. Shouldn't have moved in, buddy. Especially facing one side towards us. Crap. Warning. Armor low. Yeah, I know. Everything's gonna be low here in a minute. Yes, Commander. Pretty good shots there, but I think I wanna move in and shoot. Get more weapons in range here. Uh, just a medium pulse, but okay, fire it all. Okay, he lost something, most likely his arm. Hope it's his torso. Cataphract, okay. Cleric, I have no idea what that's got. Why does that make me think it's got like a flail or something on it? I think he's got a T-Samp, that guy. Okay, I think eighty seven on this guy, eh? He's lost his arm. His torso damaged. Let's see if we can finish him up. Nope. I think that was his torso. And he went down. Okay. Not much of a threat over there right now. I think we roll back to the left here. Damage minimal. Waiting for orders. Copy that, Commander. What do you think, guys? I think we should finish him up. Let's do that. Fire. Scored a critical hit. Yeah, but not quite enough damage. Come on. It's taking too too long to kill these guys. What was that? Warning. Enemy sensor lock detected. See what we do here. Okay, arm gone. Torso destroyed, mech destroyed. Okay. Enemy down. One down. Receiving you. Scoring 
Full speed, no target. Trying to give them another target rather than the Orion to shoot at. Let's start off in this Thunderbolt. I know that uh, Timberwolf's going to be getting up, but one more round on him and he's going down. So I want to start on some of these other guys here. This guy's going to be a problem. We don't kill him quickly. He's going to be the subject of the next melee attack as well. Yeah. Can't afford to lose either of my arms either, so... Gotta keep my front pointed at these guys. Okay, it's mostly torso and center torso hits, which is just as bad. Finally getting up that Timberwolf. See what he does. He can't hide from us. Strange he's not moving though. Okay, I think those are um, LBX 10s. He's overheating though. Get the whirly dues. Get our stability back. Warlord. Everything on this guy. Fire. Hopefully we can clean this guy up. If we can kill this guy and kill the uh, Timberwolf this turn, I'll be happy. Then those wolfhounds, we got to get rid of them. Those are PPC fodder, though. Commander? Copy that, Commander. Okay, let's get Warlord working this time. And let's clean up this Timberwolf, I think. We'll drop it all on him and fire. Nice. Okay, I was worried about that second lance. Still kind of worried about it because it's shooting at a distance, which is a pain in the ass. Yep. Yeah. Grasshopper's moving in a second anyway. Commander. All right, let's take advantage of this guy. Groin shot. Okay, that clears out our flank. Standing by. Um. Taking damage in the right arm and the left leg. Let's come in here. Let's go after this guy. Let's just do it. Okay, I think that's where his PPC was. Okay, he's haywired. No, that's one of his launchers. I think his PPC's over here. Cataphract is finally making his way into battle. He's gonna overheat real fast, that guy. Tag me though. Commander, I'm hit. Yeah. Okay, let's see what they do here. He's got to cool off too, that guy. Like both those wolfhounds do. Alright, he's in death range now. Alright. 
Oh shit. That's a lot of movement. Yeah, why did I know it felt like it was a melee mech to me? Oh, that really hurt. Yeah. Okay, he's shut down though. Okay, that's interesting. Why would you shoot at these guys? All right, Steve. Can't get a back shot on that guy. So if we can't get a back shot, let's work on the side from over here. Um, yeah, we only use three. Fire in three. Um, CT him, I guess. Maybe we can. Well, if we leg him, he's not going to be moving. Three hundred and forty-one damage. At least he's not going to be moving far if we leg him. Enemy Error not set. Pilot injured. Moving out. Everything on the leg. At least they're ignoring Saint. Warning. Armor low. Order. Okay, we got the leg off him. Wow, they had Saint dead to rights and they just left her alone. Yes, Commander. Okay. Back in action. We don't have any sprint because we don't have a leg. We're not melee. We can't melee because we don't have a leg. Um. Huh? Sure. Damn it, my mech is limping. Uh, let's go for the torso and fire. Failed to connect. Twenty-eight. Well, at least he's shooting for us. Yeah, they can't do much. Climax tend to run hot. I mean, they got those nice big opening alpha strikes, and then after that, they just kind of fizzle out, especially in Martian and lunar terrains. Gotta move a little bit. Torso shots, let's leave off the MML-7. Fire the rest. Okay, another head hit. Full throttle. 
Okay, torso again. Two shots. And firing. Okay. Oh, we had a vibro sword. Okay, so that guy's next. Standing by. Um, gonna leave off. Jeez, what do we leave off here? A tag? It won't matter. Medium pulse. Let's go this route. Tarso and leg going down. They're shooting, buddy. Cataphract is the next scary thing. Ready for orders. Yeah, might as well. Move impaired, walk impaired, senses impaired. Oh, from the uh, right haywire. Whoops. Should not be running your mech to shut down, buddy. Can we get around the front of you? We most certainly can. God, I've been taking a lot of damage, though. Three firing. Catapult is amazingly getting away completely unscathed. It's got the C3 Master in it right now. I don't really know if it's giving us all that much advantage. Uh, we're not overheating. We're fine. Fire it. Reporting critical hit. Cataphract is starting to scare me. It's getting in close too, and I don't like that. What's up, boss? I gotta move the Mjolnir out of there. Position confirmed. Got our warlord back. Everything on this guy. Let's see if we can take him out of the battle. Okay. That's a kill. That is a kill. Receiving you. Just keep moving away. from that cataphract. Don't let him see you. Whatever you do. Locked on. Scored a critical hit. What's this guy gonna do now? Still got lots of weapons though, that's the scary thing. He's got no, no CT though. Here it comes. Ah, we got lucky. Six damage. It penned though. I don't know where it's penned though. Probably went into the torso. Okay. Not liking that. Damage minimal. 
No, sir. I don't like it. Where are you moving? Keep getting close, buddy. Because guess why? Ah, uh, you're not shut down, but still. Wow. Um, why well, such a low chance to hit? ECMs and stuff, maybe? Not that it matters. Did we just strip him of all his weapons? No. I'm here. You gotta keep moving. Affirmative. Finally. Cataphract, please. Um Yeah, we gotta start on this guy. Mm. It's forty percent. 54, 99, but he's got full back armor. Chances are we don't kill this guy. Let's go up to the cataphract. Firing. Yeah, fire it all. Okay. Enemy down. Let's hope this meal near. Confirm. It's a battle of the limping ma limpo machines. Okay. Just hoping that would happen. We do not want to be close to this guy. Full Left side's got more armor than the right, so let's just do that. Firing all three. All okay, two hits. Waiting for orders. Move order received. Everything on this guy. 47 now, huh? Firing. Okay, looks like we penned somewhere. Get a little bit of a height advantage. And fire everything. Okay. Orders. On my way. Just gonna fire. Thought about trying to give myself a better chance to hit, but an extra five percent or six percent is not gonna do much at that point. Standing by. Work on trying to make him unstable again here. One rack of MMLs off. Okay, he lost something. Critical hit, Commander. There he goes, he's down. Still gotta move, Steve. Just in case he gets up again. Let's go up to the other leg. And yeah, fire. Waiting for orders. I think we got him now. Let's try and take this leg. Um uh, Yep, firing. That should do it. Really? Some heavy damage. On my way. Waiting for orders. This guy's got like nothing left. Uh-huh. 
Did not get the leg, I don't that's think. Oh well, well that's a four and a half skull clanner. All right, payment increased by twenty percent. We'll need that for sure for repairs. I'm e expecting around three hundred thousand repairs. Lost a meal near his leg, but overall we did pretty well. I think I don't think we lost any internal components, except for whatever was in the leg here. Talons. That's a huge loss, though. Let's see if we got any more talons here. The cleric might have had some. Oh. So a lot of mech parts, cataphract. One timber wolf part. We stripped that guy something awful. ATM nine. It's another one. Let's bring that in just in case. Um, Ultra L LBX ten pirate. Eighteen double. That was on the cleric, I guess. Exposed ammo feed will explode for. Weapon fails out to 40% of their maximum. 30% chance to be damaged or explode after firing. Yeah, that's that's great. Case 2 clan, we can't use. We need regular case. Gyro HEV, what's this? Huh. Double heat sinks, double heat sink kits. Heavy leg actuator, plus 5% melee damage. NSI cockpit, one defense and two act. Look at this thing. Two accuracy range weapons, plus 25% weapon damage dealt. Plus five, are you kidding me? Plus five initiative? Damn, taking that. Okay, we got one of these already. Weapon mount, um, Artemis ammo. We didn't, there's no talons or anything here. I wonder what, I wonder how that clerk was doing so much damage. Um, that talons is a huge loss. How was that clerk doing so much damage? I don't see any melee stuff here. Must have just been chassis, well, the Viber Blade or whatever it was, most likely. Case 2 Clan. Yeah, I don't know. Clan ER Large. Possibility. Not a lot of clan gear in here. It's kind of sad in a way. It was Ghost Bear, so I guess it was one of the reserve units. This defensive gyro is nice too. Don't have any right now. But I think these three are probably the best way to go out of what we have here. So let's confirm this. So Cataphract Part, Phoenix Hawk, Thunderbolt, Wolfhound, meh. Small pulse laser, whoop de doo double heat sink, double, yeah, garbage, slick sweet. Yeah, all right, well. That mech is ready to fight, Commander. We just got a cataphract, really? Spiky. Bonus melee damage from what I understand. Yeah, almost, that's whatever we made in sea bills is what we're going to be paying out in 47 days in repairs. Good thing we have a second lance to run. But it wasn't about that. It was about taking on the clans of four and a half skulls. So that was actually pretty good, although they weren't really clan mechs, unfortunately. But, you know, do what we can. All right, so let's move uh, the Orion in here to get repaired. And then the Victor and the Catapult last. We've got uh, our second lance. That we can pull off missions before the end of the month anyway so our main lance will be down for the rest of the month I think but the second lance can probably pull off a couple more um, yeah so I'm gonna leave the episode here um, so I think yeah I think this weekend might be the end for Funky Steve um, the series I think will come to a close this weekend 
So uh, if you got any suggestions, just drop it in the comment section down below. Uh, I really want to start working on the 998 series, uh, both of them, the uh, Night Witches and the Jade uh, Falcon Freeborn. So those are the most up-to-date versions, and it seems like everyone seems to be more uh, interested in those. So I'll just uh, sort of try and sum up this series at the end of the this uh, or end of this weekend. So probably a four or five more episodes anyway. Um, I might go after that uh, once a week or something. I don't know, but we'll see how it goes. It's just uh, it's taxing to do uh, more than two series at a time. So anyway, we're gonna leave it there. And uh, if you like the episode, drop a like. Um, until next time, we'll see you later.